Bayer Club, Big Clue Clue, Oli Lanza. Now what's going on? The Yukels have stored all of the things I've managed to take out of the clinic. That's so nice of them. Watcher should already have spoken. Our friend the shaman is up there. She's resting after the ritual and I'm making sure she has everything she needs. Finally! Miss Catwalk, finally! They're damp from being outside. How odd! A kind of pan or oven, I guess. You okay? Shouldn't we cross the bridge soon so that everyone can get to safety? Our sacred bridge collapsed. This new bridge looks pretty good. What's the matter? The sacred bridge is just there. That thing. It's a customs post. With, I imagine, a policeman and paperwork. It's not for us. So I guess this isn't at all compatible with your very specific rights and beliefs. Indeed, Kate Walker. Even if the caravan received the blessing of the spirits in Olympia? We still need the approval of the Watcher. 
And given the state of the bridge, I'm very worried about that. Who's he? The guardian of the sacred lands, a very great sage. It is said that he is ageless, that he has seen migrations without number, and has always lived in that yurt over there on the other side. He's the one who attests that the good fortune granted by the spirits during last night's ceremony will indeed accompany the caravan. No Yukal may cross the sacred river without his approval. Does that apply to non yukals too? In principle, no. What do you have in mind? I'll go across the other bridge myself to see what's happening with the Watcher. What does the blessing of the Watcher consist of? He grants us passage if he deems us worthy. If we have respected the customs and traditions, all that sort of stuff. What do you know about that other bridge? The old people say it wasn't there on the last migration. It is like the countryside we have crossed. Everything has changed, and it is difficult to adapt our traditions to these new things. Do you think they'll let us cross over the new structures? Because of the trading we have done on the way, we have money. Perhaps it will be enough to give some to the people occupying the bridge. Are you really sure that the people chasing us won't be able to do anything once we're across the river? Certain. Crazy as they are, they would never take the risk of committing an act of war by violating a sovereign border. What is it, Kate Walker? You seem troubled. The thing is, I'm thinking about the way back, Kirk. Afterwards, how are you going to get the herd back home with Olga and those soldiers waiting for you? To everything there is a time. First, we have to obtain the benediction of the Watcher. Hmm. I see. I'll go see how we can cross. See you later. Thank you for everything, Kate Walker. Hello. Oh, uh, hello there, miss. Uh, um, yes, uh, what's this about? I'm accompanying the migration of the Yukal tribe. They usually cross the river right at this spot about every 20 years. But their bridge collapsed, 
and they aren't allowed to use the new structures without the approval of their, well, he's a kind of spiritual customs officer, and he lives on the other side. I absolutely have to cross so that I can meet him. Can you let me cross, please? Well, now, I, I heard about those famous nomads a while back, but actually seeing them in the flesh, I've only been at this post for a few months. Uh, well, you just need to show me the appropriate documents, I guess, and uh, yes, there you go. Listen, the Yukels are going to stay here until I return. That way you'll know that I'll be coming back here as soon as I can. So that way we can stop losing time with all these annoying procedures. And, uh, what happens when you finally get back? Since they don't have the right papers, I'm sure the Yukels will agree to give you a good chunk of their savings to smooth things over. That will compensate for any nuisance they've caused. Uh, what are you talking about, miss? Cash. Lots of cash. To get you to look the other way while they cross to the other side. Ah, well, I just have to go and see what my boss says when I call. It's like they're always telling us, rule number one, always inform your superiors. And rule number two, in case of doubt, be sure to refer to rule number one. The idea is for you not to go calling on your superiors. You keep the money for yourself, see? You get it? Uh, okay, well, I don't actually know if I can actually do that. Uh... But remember, you can't tell anyone, but you should think about it. With that much money, you'll be able to become a full-time fisherman. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, uh, right. Uh, well, okay, that's fine. However, you actually just need to engage the water wheel in the river there. Uh, to activate the bridge, and so I can use it to authorize you to cross. There are so many people traveling with you in your group, I don't want to leave my post. That won't be necessary. I took care of the motor already. You did what? But... but you should have asked. Well, you have to admit the timing is good. Uh... Well, yeah. Yeah, that's true. So, tell me when you actually want to cross? But why was the old Yukul bridge that was here before destroyed? It wasn't really all that sturdy, from what I was told. They were looking for something more uh, effective in terms of actual border control. Meaning? Well, as you can see, it's made of... Uh, two co-interdependent mobile components. And I'm the one who activates it here. So it's really the safest border in the world. Um, anyway, that's what my superiors told me. Well, no offense, sir, but you seem a bit hesitant. When was the last time you saw someone here? <sighs> yes? Well, to be honest, I've actually been here for six months, and I never saw anybody. Not a soul. Nobody. Well, I don't talk much, which is kind of understandable, you know. Sometimes I do a little fishing to keep busy. I mean, I may end up actually talking with the dead fish. I see. Do you know if there's still somebody on the other side? Uh, well, I've never been there, actually. I, I don't have the right. It's foreign. Apart from the crazy guy who lives there, I've never seen anybody, but... The one living in that yurt? On the other side? Yeah, he's a little monster. Uh, my border contact, as the manual says. Do you know him personally? Well, I never actually saw him close up, because he's on the other side. Makes sense. And, uh, to be totally honest, uh, it's kind of like 
Sometimes we just trade provisions using the zip line they went and had installed over the river when they built the bridge. The old guy really does like his booze, you know. So I sent him over a couple of bottles of vodka from time to time. You know, just a matter of maintaining pretty good border relations, like I said. Well, I am going to the other side. Okay. Yeah, okay. Why not? Um, just go over there, right in front of the bridge, and I'll take you across then. Oh, yes, that's her. Kate Walker. The one who left her old life far behind her. So since then, she's been running, and she isn't stopping. A traveler with no destination. Hello. Sorry for interrupting your, uh, conversation, but... The spirits love to have a chat, Kate Walker. And they love interfering in our affairs. Spirits? Sometimes they protect you. Sometimes they abandon you to your fate. We have trouble understanding them. They tell me that Kate Walker is accompanying the new migration of the yokels and their ostriches. That's right. The Yukels need your benediction to be able to cross, and... They say a great danger threatens you. The spirits like to warn of danger. It makes them feel important. Yes, people are chasing us. Which means it's even more important for us to have your authorization to cross. But first, there's a test. With the spirits, there are always tests to pass. And there are always presents you have to give. You may give anything you wish, just as long as it's vodka. I didn't know the spirits liked to drink. I'll be doing the drinking, and through me, the spirits will get soused. It puts them in a very good mood. Yeah, I see. And after that, you'll let us pass? You must also recite the incantation. And then after that, the caravan may go to the sacred lands. Did the spirits say anything else about me? Your virtues. They may ultimately cause your loss, Kate Walker. Be careful, Took. That's all. 
From trials comes strength. Your spirits really do like to generalize. And what about that alcohol you need? Where can I get some? That should not pose any problem at all for Kate Walker. The spirits don't have a particularly favorite brand. Can you tell me more about the incantation we have to recite? It's a prayer to the spirits that's been handed down from shaman to shaman. And what kind of prayer? The spirits need signs. They understand the language of fire and smoke. It is hoped that Kate Walker will find what is needed on the other side of the river. The remains of migration's past are still there, but the spirits only reveal all secrets once the offering of vodka has been made. The spirits are very uncompromising when it comes to business, Kate Walker. Okay. I've got work to do. I'll go find a way to get you something you can use to toast your immaterial friends with. The spirits are also very sensitive, Kate Walker. They don't like being laughed at, so... waiting for. How do you feel, Mrs. Ayahuasca? Trance of ceremonies eat all strengths. So shaman, very, very weak. I'm sorry to interrupt your convalescence, but there's a problem with the Watcher on the other side of the bridge. What problem? Ask for fuel for spirits? Vodka always fuel for spirits. Yes. Would you happen to have any in your provisions? 
No more fuel. Shaman, all used up for sacred ritual. It doesn't matter, don't worry about it. I'll find another way of getting some. The Watcher also asked me to recite a kind of prayer so that the tribe can cross. Can you tell me more about that? Miss Kate Walker must make signals of smoke with old machines of the ancestors. Signals? Ayahuasca uses sometimes above. Our friend the shaman is up there. She's resting after the ritual, and I'm making sure she has everything she needs. They're damp from being outside.
The bridge controls are right there. Well, well. With the customs officer gone, there's no way to get the Yukels across without someone staying on this side. Right. Well, we'll see about that later. Sawdust.
No way.
We have the Watcher's blessing for the crossing. Thank you, Kate Walker. On behalf of the entire tribe, a thousand thank yous. There's one problem. Without the customs officer, there's no one left to work the bridge, and... I have the solution, Kate Walker. It looks like someone will have to stay on this bank so the others can cross. And I'm clearly the one to do that. No, Oscar. Not again. Kate Walker, once you find yourself safely across with the tribe, just use the zip line that I saw you enjoying yourself with a short time ago to bring me across in turn. No. We'll swap roles. I'll get you across first, and then I'll cross with the zip line. Your concern serves no purpose, Kate Walker. And... The soldiers. We have to go. Oscar! Kate Walker! We need help! Quick! Elevator control. Inversion. Engage. Oscar! Kate Walker! No! Perhaps you are looking for this. The game is over now, Kate Walker. Well, Miss Walker. Very well. You've won, I suppose. Walker, 
Please take advantage of the trip to relax. We will have plenty of time to chat when we get there. All the time we need.